Hello everyone, welcome to solve this nice math all on paid algebra problem. So here we have a nice exponential equation in which x to the power of x equals 25 and we solve this problem for the values of x. So here uh, you see here we have the uh, base and exponents both are variables. So we have the variable becomes in base as well as exponent so that here uh, we need to take the natural log on both of the sides of this equation uh, so that when we take uh, this natural log it is written as log of x to the power of x is equals to log of 25 and after that uh, here we use the nice property of log and you very well know about this property if we have log of a to the power of n so according to this property of log we move this exponent n in the front of this log and it is written as n times of log a so here we need uh, this nice property of log in order to solve the bavik equation or to find the value of x uh, so that according to this property here we move this exponent x in the front of this log and it is written as uh, x times of log x is equals to log of 25. So here uh, uh, I can uh, solve this problem with the help of Lambert W function and you uh, already know about the Lambert W function. It is a very uh, interesting uh, uh, function uh, and it is very helpful to solve this type of uh, exponential equation problem okay so that uh, first we introduce the uh, lambert w function and we know that if you have w of a to the power a into e to the power of a it is equals to a it means that if you have the exponent of e is multiplied by here then the output of this type of function becomes here the exponent of e and it is a likewise if i can just give you the example of this Lambert W function if you have a yeah, particular case is that if you have uh, 3 into e to the power of 3 so uh, the output of this type of function becomes here uh, 3 okay so now here we solve uh, the above equation uh, with the help of uh, this Lambert W function but here uh, in order to use this Lambert W function first uh, we make our uh, function in this form it means that first we make the exponential function with base e and here we multiply the exponent of this function by here so that now we uh, write our left hand side of this equation uh, in this form uh, so here you focus on uh, this x and you you see here if you have x uh, and when we take the log and anti log at the same time of this value x it is written as e to the power of log of x we know that e and log are anti by each other so if if both of these numbers are become at the same time so these are cancelled by each other so it means that this log and this e are cancelled by each other so we again get our x it means that we write our x in this form so now here we replace this x by e to the power of log x in order to make this condition okay so here first we replace this x by this value and it is written as e to the power of uh, log x and here we have log of x and it is, it is equals to log of 25 and after that uh, you see here uh, the exponent of e is multiplied by here and in the right hand side we have log of 25 uh, and now here uh, we are ready to apply the Lambert W function on both of the sides of this equation so that here we apply j just this W on both of the sides and it is written as W of log x into e to the power of log x is equals to W of log 25 okay so uh, after this step uh, now we uh, uh, use the Lambert W function in the left hand side of this equation uh, so you see here uh, this log x is over a it means that if this is over a and this is also over a so that the output of this type of uh, Lambert W function becomes here the exponent of e so here you have the exponent of e is log x so we write this output of this uh, term is log of x and this is equals to 
w of uh, log 25 okay so because in this question our target is to find the value of x and now in order to remove this log here we need to uh, eliminate this log uh, from left hand side so that and uh, now uh, here we just take the anti log on both of the sides of this equation so that when we take anti log it is written as e to the power of log of x is equals to e to the power of w into log of 25 okay so here uh, we uh, just uh, see that this e and log are cancelled by each other and we get the left hand side is x is equals to e to the power of uh, w of log of 25 so that uh, now uh, in the next step uh, this is the our final answer if you uh, if this question is lies on your exam then you can uh, you can just stop this question from here this is our final answer but uh, if you have some assignment question then you can use the wall from alpha in order to get the uh, exact value of this type of function so here you see that uh, if uh, uh, we have if you can find the value of this lambert w function of log 25 and its exponent is e so this value uh, after using the calculator or lambert w or wolf uh, from alpha uh, uh, you can easily get the value of this type of function uh, is equals to is approximately equals to uh, 2.963 okay but here in some cases you can uh, in your exam you because you cannot have access to uh, to the wall from alpha uh, so that here uh, you can just stop this question from here and this is the our final answer okay so uh, now if uh, you can just verify uh, this equation then you substitute this value of x uh, into the given equation uh, so that uh, to verify uh, this value here we first copy down the given question statement and our given question statement is x to the power of x equals to 25 and here we substitute this value of x here and it will be written as 2.963 and its exponent is 2.963 so here uh, if you can use the calculator then you will easily get the uh, value of this type of exponential function and and this is approximately is equals to 25 so uh, if this is equals to 25 so this is also equals to 25 then you see that clearly the value of x is satisfied this equation and this is the our final answer of this question and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos